and welcome to my Ultra Life. I'm here in Rome for the fourth part of our Running Through Italy series. And uh, it looks pretty light out, but it's actually only about 5.45 in the morning. Uh, in Rome, we decided to stay at a real hotel. Instead of a funky little hotel in town or bed and breakfast, which we've had great experiences at these places. This hotel, Holiday Inn, uh, it's just a little far out of town, so uh, unfortunately, well, or fortunately, I'm going to get my long run in today. That's why I'm started earlier than uh, I normally do, and um, the sights may not be right in town, but uh, thanks to a taxi driver who took a really long drive, um, maybe we can show you some interesting sights today. So let's uh, get running and uh, enjoy our run through Rome. Well, I'm about uh, three miles into my run. I must be getting a little bit closer to town because uh, alongside the road here is an ancient Roman aqueduct. Uh, all these columns and, and things. And uh, back a little ways there, we saw some uh, archways that were barely above the road. And I think that indicates just how old this road is and how built up over time uh, the city has become. This road I'm on is called uh, Ariella Antica, and uh, apparently this, Rome, this uh, road was built in ancient Roman times, and at one point it went all the way from Rome to Spain. So it's amazing to me that I'm running on a road that's more than 2,000 years old, and at 6 in the morning it's pretty busy. I gotta watch myself, it's pretty narrow. And uh, imagine what stories this road could tell the people that built it, the people that traveled on it over the last 2,000 years. So it's uh, pretty amazing when you think about it. So three miles in, I have no idea how many miles it is to get to where we're gonna go, where we can have a sight of the overview of Rome. So. Uh, I guess I better keep running. Well, this is the second gate on the road, so I think we're uh, getting closer to the center of Rome. Uh, and I believe this is the entrance to the park, which will uh, take us to our destination. I'm in uh, Giancolo Park. This is a monument on the, the top of the hill overlooking the city of Rome. And let's see if we can get any uh, views of it. Well, here's looking uh, down onto Rome a little before seven in the morning. It's a little overcast. Hard to see, but it's out there. No Facebook. Huh? No Facebook. No, no Facebook. Huh? Sure. No, I wanted to get a picture of that before I ran back. <laughs> Okay, have a good time. Bye-bye. Well, I've left the uh, peace and quiet of Giancolo Park and uh, heading down a very narrow road here that, uh, according to my map, should lead me directly to the Vatican. Uh, it's downhill all the way, which means it's going to be uphill on the way back. So let's see if I read my map correctly and find the Vatican.
Wow, I've made it to the Vatican. I'm in St. Peter's Piazza, which is the uh, opening, beginning uh, piazza leading into the Vatican complex. It looks like uh, they're setting up the huge Disney type line for uh, visitors later today. This uh, on the map, this complex looks huge. And uh, if this is just the entryway, I can only imagine. But uh, I'm amazed. I'm at the Vatican. This is cool. This is uh, part four of uh, running through Italy. Rome. Well, St. Peter's Square is going to be my turnaround point. I thought maybe there would be a shortcut. I, I looked at the map. I thought maybe there'd be a, a little shortcut home, but I think it's be safer just to go back the way I came. So I'll be traveling my uh, Ariala Antica, a uh, 2000 year old road, once again back to my hotel as uh, part of my wrap up for the fourth in the series of uh, running through Italy. Here we go, back home. I did find the new road uh, home. It's still Ariella, but it's the new one. Except I hate forks in the road. Uh, I gotta look at this map and see. Make sure I don't get lost. Morning. Well, that completes our uh, run through Rome and finalizes our run through Italy series. And uh, this morning it'll be about a 10 and a half mile run. Great views of Rome. Beautiful view of uh, St. Peter's Square. And uh, now I'm back to the hotel. I think I'm going to jump in the pool. And then I've got a long day of touring to see the sights of Rome all day. But I think I'm going to ride one of those hop, and off, hop on, hop off buses. So no more running, not a lot of walking there. Just uh, taking it easy to see the sights. Try to cool down. Now I've had an ultra life day, and I hope you do too.